Hello, it's me after fucking three weeks of not uploading. Um, I needed to do something for three weeks, so that's why I'm here. So, um, this is New Jeans, um, Get Up. I just heard this is a really good EP. Um, this is one of the best EPs out there. So, l l let's see if that's really true. L let's see if we actually get some cool, good weightings here. All right. First track, New Jeans. like the instrumental this beat is ooh, it's giving me some nostalgia vibes I, I really like this beat this is a uh, from like a video game ooh. okay damn I did not even know that this was a female artist oh my god Ooh, that bridge. Yeah. Let's go dig in. I like the repetition here. It, this is like Weaver, but without the Weaver, but it still has the same impact, you know? It has like the same purpose, which makes it even better because uh, Weaver can kind of sound bad to this artist, but it's really good. Ooh. I like the, I like the beat switch. It's sudden, but like it doesn't ruin the song or it, or the flow. I really like the switch up of the beat there. Like the spooky beat. Like I, I didn't expect that. Um, but yeah, I give that first track. Um, new jeans. Basically, the title track is honestly. Um. I'll give that a cool. I really like that song. It, it, it sounded pleasant and, and enjoyable. It kept me on my toes. You know, I, I think it's a cool. I think an appreciation to the K-pop genre, which I really don't have right now because all I listen because I listen to PTS and Blackpink and then corporate. But this doesn't sound corporate. This sounds actually genuine. Um, you can even tell that by the uh, album cover, which um, I'm probably going to like more when I delve into this more. Okay, next song, Super Shy. Just... Ooh, okay. A little bit of a switch up in the lyrics. Like the, like the lightning, surprisingly. Um, even though it's kind of repetitive. Okay, a little bit simple. Okay, a little bit of fast tempo. Like again in the first track. Like in the first track. Ooh, okay, I'm vibing. Okay, she's like kind of being confident, but like she, she's shy but confident. Uh, but it kind of makes sense in a way. All right, well, I give that second track. Well, it's not good as the first one because I do think it has some notable flaws. I still th waited a good. Um, it is really, um, I I can see it lyrically being better than the first one but um i just think it's a bit but the repetitive nature is a little bit more annoying on that one but i still think the song is enjoyable and and it's fun listening to it honestly and the lyrics aren't really that bad so um next song eta which i think is more korean than um english judging by the lyrics here okay this this album has some really fun beats so far. T E T A. What's your E T A? I, I really like that. I really like that line. I, I don't mind that it gets uh, repeated or like it's a many chorus because um, I just think it's really catchy. I can see the passion in her voice. The her voice kind of switches there. Um, it and it was like a really clean transition. It. It just was very impactful and necessary in that. So I really like that ETA. They do. What's your ETA? What's your ETA? What's your ETA? Ho hopefully ETA doesn't sound appropriate. Uh, 
And I'm not gonna look it up, uh, only when I'm editing. I like the outro here. That was a high good. I've actually liked that s song a lot. Um, I think it's more than it's super shy actually because it it was more eventful. It sticked more with the theme. All right, next song, cool with you. And then we have an interlude. It seems like in an EP, which is interesting. Okay, another WB. Okay. A little bit of house incorporated. Okay, nice pleasant build up. Okay, like the tone of voice of the different group members, like the switch up in their voices. Mental outro that's fucking so slaps. This this is perfect. All right, giving that song a cool. Um, it made me very immersive. Um, and I love the tone. I love the switches and the voice and the transitions on clean. You know, it it was it was just really really impactful. I feel like. Every part of a song does that way. Okay, get up. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay, uh, I like how this is. Wait. That, cool, cool, I don't know what to say, that was the, probably one of the best interludes I've ever heard. It was so simple, but uh, in context of the EP, really fucking solid. Um, last song, ASAP. It's me again, I'm back, let's talk ASAP, they have the time, let's talk ASAP, baby. Hurry up, don't be, be lazy. He is a baby. Hurry up, don't say maybe. That that is a very relatable line. I love the tick tack tick tack tick 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 Ooh, like the experimental type beat. This is really, this is really unique. Ooh. Okay, good instrumental moment. I feel like it flows well with the tick 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 This is very simple but very like relatable at the same time. And a cool transition to the last song. Alright, um now that EP I'm gonna give that a cool obviously. Um new jeans, I I honestly never heard of him until this EP. But 
really fucking good. Um, I I recommend. I'm gonna I'm gonna probably listen to more because that was such a mind blowing EP. Um, it sound you can pass it off as like um just generic k-pop music but i think it's actually something different because it brings in some new production bring in some new voices bring in some new transitions you know like it's i think it's just really unique to the k-pop genre um which it desperately needs right now so yeah that was a pleasant listen oh give that album a cool um and see ya bye